so excited about Mothers in Crisis. We're celebrating 25 years of service. Glory to God. And as a part of our celebration, we're talking to those that Mothers in Crisis has helped along the way and made an impact in their lives. Like my very, very special, special Ruby Harris, who's been such a wonderful, mwah, just a Thank wonderful you. part of Mothers in Crisis over the years. Why don't you look into the camera and just tell the audience how Mothers in Crisis has helped you and your family? Well, I've been a part of Mothers in Crisis since 1996, and it has been such a blessing to me. And um, since then, I've um, graduated from TCC, I've graduated from FAMU, I attended FSU, and um, things have been going great for me. And that's been a while, yes. that's been a long time. <laughs> But there's not a day that goes by where I don't, I always don't forget where you came from. And I know without Mothers in Crisis, I would not be where I am today. It helped me out so much, tremendously. Before then, my life was in a whirlwind. There was no tomorrow, like no plans of what you're doing today. But they helped me, my Mothers in Crisis helped me focus on my future. Right now, I have six grandkids. My one of my granddaughters are in um, Orlando studying for her master's degree. All right. Yeah, and so God has truly, truly blessed me through Mothers in Crisis, and I'm glad that He brought me to Florida, where Mothers in Crisis was founded. Yes. Because I moved from New York to here, and you know, I was here for a year, and then I got involved with Mothers in Crisis. And I'll never forget that. Wow. But thank you so much. <laughs> thank you. So we just want to just continue to remind you, Mothers in Crisis, we're having a soiree, and we, that's an evening party. Okay. <laughs> On April the 15th, we're having a book signing, we're having a seminar, and bringing in an international, worldwide missionary mm -hmm. that's going to come and speak to us, and we're having our reunion service on that Sunday. That's this April the 17th. So stay tuned. Always remember, as long as there's breath in your body, there's hope. We're taking it to the next level, Hope 2.0 spreading hope around the world. <laughs> Thank you.